Okay. What was your first reaction when you found out Andalet wanted you? Joy. Massive joy and uh, proud as well because uh, Anderlecht is Belgium's biggest club, most successful club in Europe as well, so proud, very proud. Kamar, why did you choose Anderlecht? It was an easy decision. Um, massive club in Belgium. Um, and Vincent Company being over here, if he's wanting you, then it must be a, it's a good feeling if someone like him wants you. Um, so it was a, for me, it was an easy decision. Um, the project for this season is obviously to win trophies, um, qualify for the top competitions, and I want to be a part of it. As a keeper, you are very good with your feet. How did you shape those skills? Good question. Um, I think one of the main reasons is that I played a long time as a, as a normal field player and that uh, at the age of 12 I had to decide to become a field player or a goalie and most people say I'm, I was better as a goalie so I became a goalie and I had a good Spanish goalkeeper coach in, in Open, my former club, who had his um, his youth academy in Barcelona so they know how to play with feet and he transmitted this technique to, to me and I, 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 I adapted quite, quite fast. Yes, I saw upstairs when um, the opposition was closing this down and you did some chop chop yeah. and then passed it to the side. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Well, the coach said it was too risky. It was too risky. <laughs> it was too risky. <laughs> he said it's a good emergency exit, yes. but he said it's quite risky. <laughs> what are your ambitions with our club? Win as many trophies and games as possible. How did your first week at Anderlet go? It was uh, a strange week because I spent only two days on the pitch with the, with the, with the lads before, before playing the first game in Mucron. So it was a week of uh, a lot of negotiations between Anderlecht and my former club. So I spent most time outside the field, but uh, happy to be on the field and, and happy to have a, a first clean sheet. Could you describe your style of play in three words? Hard working. Um, creative, fun. You had several offers over the past few years. Why did you think now was a good time to go for a new challenge? It's true that I had some good offers in the last years, but I never felt like completely 100% ready to make a, a move. Especially making a move to be second goalie was not uh, part of my career plan. And, now I felt that I had to move from my former club because I, I reached a limit and I wanted to, to know where my, my, my limits are. So I had to take on a new challenge and then I got a call of uh, Vincent and, and direction and I felt directly that it was the perfect challenge for me to, to develop myself as a person and as a player. What are your first impressions of the country, the training facilities, the stadium? Very good. Um, the country... Being in Brussels, it feels like I've been here for weeks already. I feel, I don't, I don't feel like it, it's been a, a massive change. I feel comfortable already. The training ground is very good. Um, top quality, very top quality. And just been to the stadium today. And it, you walk in and you see all the trophies from the, from the past. It's um, very nice to see. Which goalkeepers are an inspiration to you, an example? Actual football, I think uh, Ter Stegen of Barcelona, especially with his feet quality, is a, a major example. But as well, uh, Jan Oblak is a very good uh, goalie, David De Gea of Manchester United. And in history, of course, uh, Iker Casillas was one of the best and, and Gigi Buffon. But actual football, I would say Ter Stegen and uh, Oblak. Yeah. As a new player, You'll need to sign a, sing a song in front of your teammates. What do you think of my suggestion, The Roof is on Fire? Very good suggestion. I suppose it's an easy song to do, um, but it might be a bit awkward. Probably, yeah. <laughs> Probably. <laughs>